Shahriyar, what a match. I mean, this uh, Magidon game, I mean, we see, still my even hands are trembling. How do you feel after that match? Yeah, of course, it's very strange. Uh, it's uh, when it's Armageddon is time problems every time nervous and uh, you start to miss something. I think after the opening it looks like winning position for me uh, in middle game, but I start to play very strategical and uh, I just want to play a few normal moves, but move to move I uh, lose my advantage and after it was close the draw and after in game of course absolutely uh, uh, I mean, looks draw, but what to do? We need to play uh, still. Yeah, because he just needs a draw. Yeah, he needs draw, yeah. but me, okay, I have 10 seconds, 5 seconds, and okay, of course, not easy. He forgot about time, but it was a uh, very interesting game. Uh, very, uh, I don't know, I think it's, it's classical chess, it was uh, more important because I think after the middle game, I have some advantage, maybe in end game. But I start to play very bad, and uh, I think uh, uh, I lost all my uh, advantage. And somewhere it looks like a losing position for me is in game because I think I will lose. But uh, he miss. I mean, it's very strange match. Very good. Yeah, uh, it's problems uh, when we play first a very boring game, uh, first classical chess. chess. Uh, opening middle game, but after middle game start absolutely very nice, very interesting end game, uh, and uh, we both miss many moves, we have very good ideas. I think uh, he missed last one, and uh, it was uh, I think it was uh, winning for him. Yeah, I mean, what moment do you think you were kind of losing in the first classical game? I mean, in which particular moment? Because yeah. there were few, so many, and the pawns were running. Yeah, very important moment. He uh, he not take e4, my bishop, and he got end game. I mean, he, he just uh, after my move, king c4, he just take rook d3, bishop d3, and the bishop go. And I think he can take rook e4, king c5, and f3. His problems, uh, you know, uh, first rook a4, uh, a6, the f3. This pawn is f every time b6, rook a5 is check. And uh, I don't know how to play. I, I think it is losing. Maybe king b6, f3 is a long variation, and it will be king uh, queen pawn against uh, king queen in end game. But uh, I think it was it is a losing position. Wow, how far do you calculate actually? I mean, until this yeah. queen ending. Yeah, huh? yeah, queen. Ending. I think this one yeah, ending. I think it is very bad. I don't know. I, I don't check his game. Uh, I think, okay, we, we, maybe we can miss something, but it looks very bad. I think if play move to move, it looks very bad for white. Yeah, and just my last question. You mentioned yesterday it was a bit difficult to play with black when you still have this chance to make a draw. How did it feel to play today with white that you really need to win? Okay, I mean, when you play with white, you know, you know his draw is uh, not enough. You need to play for win. When be black, like yesterday, I lost the end game with extra pawn. And after the game, I check in my uh, and absolutely is w w winning position. I mean, how is possible to lose this position like yesterday? But also, how is possible to win position like today? <laughs> yeah, <It's, laughs> you have points go, have points back. It is uh, for this. Uh, I mean, it's exciting chess, and for this, uh, chess lovers love chess because every day exciting chess, very nice sacrifice. Uh, till last moment, we try to play for win. Uh, I think, uh, yeah, I lost yesterday. I lost uh, half points. Today, I back my lost uh, half. Exactly. Thank you very much, Shahriyal. We keep watching your games. Thank you.